I got the number one huge angel dog in Pet Simulator 99. As you can see, this pet is a one of one. There is no more of this inside of the game at all. And I currently own the only one. It is actually golden and that is how you normally get it. As you probably know, the way you obtain this is from the stairway to heaven. The way you can actually access this area is by going to the classic obby or any other obby and just instantly dying off the bat and pressing the home button. And as soon as you do that, you actually fall off the map and then you are teleported in the stairway to heaven. In this area, you have to basically climb an infinite amount of stairs that do not stop generating. And doing so has a very slight chance of 1 in 1 million that you get it by each stair that you climb. So as you can tell, personally, I'm not doing that. But I have managed to get the first ever huge angel dog. And to confirm that, there is an achievement right here. Is it real? You literally cannot finish this achievement, kind of. I mean, you can, but it's very, very hard. And I was curious on what kinds of offers we could get on a pet like this. Surely it would have to be very high, right? Since it's very rare. And I know my friend Expels actually traded away this pet for a Titanic. So our goal is to get a bit more than that because, I mean, it's still only one in existence and it only comes in gold. So yeah, let's go ahead and just jump into the trading plaza. Oh man, here we are. Let's see what kinds of offers we can get. Okay, we got a pretty rich server. Let's see if anybody will notice that I just have a huge angel dog. I don't know why it's not equipped, but there we go. Let's go ahead and equip it alone. Oh my gosh, bro, this server is kind of rich. But let's go ahead and say send trade to offer for golden huge angel dog since it is a one of one only. And I will also give you guys more details on how you actually get it very soon. But here we go. We got Mr. Carson trading us. So let's go put the huge angel dog in the trade. Let's see, Mr. Carson, do you have an offer to give us or are you just not going to say anything? Bro, he said no way. Yeah, man. Um, how you get it? I can't. I can't say. Even though I kind of didn't even get it myself. He said, "Please, it's top secret. Do you want to offer for it?" I mean, I did tell you guys that one day I was gonna get this pet, bro. And it looks like we got the first one. He said, I watch your videos. Thank you so much. Let's see, bro. I want to see you give me an offer for it. Okay, so we got three huge happy rocks going in the trade so far. Two huge knife cats. And I don't know if this is all he's giving us. Uh, they don't actually have any charms on them or anything. He says, this is all I have. That's a pretty good offer. Um, I'll let you know. Even though I might not actually let him know, just in case I forget. But I do want to look at more offers. I mean, if it can get a Titanic, why would I take that trade? But we got Maybus, May, or May, Maybus, whatever that means. Um, and they're giving us a huge hologram shark. I don't think I can accept that. I'm so sorry. It's just not enough, bro. Okay, let's go put it in this trade right here. Let's see. Unknown Flames, do you got anything sweet? Bro wants to give it to me. Or he wants it for one gem. Yeah, bro. This is a really good deal. No, I'm joking, bro. I'm not taking that. He said really good deal. I know, right, bro? It's the best deal. All right, we got Mr. Sand Crazy, bro. I hate I have to keep, like, searching for the bed just because it's a huge. He said only one exists still. Wow, can I unlock my pets? Uh, sure. You know, let's go ahead and let him unlock his pets. See if he can give us any sweet offers. Okay, we got Iwa trading us in the meantime while the other person unlocks. And, okay, this guy has... Whoa, hold up, bro. Oh, my God. He's putting in a lot. Okay, huge lucky, Dominus. Uh, oh, my God. Whoa, why are the huge pets, like, going to the top and at the bottom? Okay, we got a huge Clover Dragon, Rainbow Huge Happy Rock, uh, two Comet Cyclopses, Cosmic Axolotl, 
three lucky dominances two normal happy rocks uh oh my god dude it's just so much dude he's giving all of this for one huge bet this is insane okay let's go say oh wow this is a very good offer here i'll let you guys decide do we take this offer out of all the offers we're gonna get in this video here i'm gonna tell him i'll i'll let the comments decide if i should do this trade or not he said okay all right that was a really good offer not gonna lie bro i want to see if i can get any like really crazy offers that'll actually make me want to trade it away because who knows i might just want to keep it bro just because of how expensive it is he said, I am not that great. I will give my best offer. Okay, let's see it. We have uh, five huge happy rocks. Oh, wait. This one has a bonus um, charm to it. Yeah, one of them has a bonus, bro. That's pretty cool. He's also giving us a huge goblin, which also has a bonus. And as well as 21,000 ninja mascots. Also, what in the world just happened to my game? Even if you don't accept, can you say W lifeless for my vid? Well, I just said it. But let's go say W lifeless. Thank you so much for the offer because it's not bad. I mean, it, it's probably not going to be the best that we're going to get, but it's not terrible. Also, what just happened to my game, bro? Look at all of these errors. Okay, there we go, bro. I finally fixed. Let's see what my boy Pets in Person Nope has. He said hi. Let's go say hi. I'm looking for Diamond V. Sir, this is a huge angel dog. Um, I think this is what you should want. But I sadly don't have any Diamond Vs, bro. I'm so sorry. Okay, I got my friend Dap Roblox actually offering. Let's see what he has to give. I don't know if he actually wants to offer or he just wants to talk or something, but I would love to see him offer. He said, you got a fortune enchant I can trade for. I'm so sorry. I don't right now, but I do have this that you can offer for for a video. He says, I have to pass at the moment. Okay, that's fair. If you guys didn't know, he used to actually get the best pet inside of Petsamex like a while back. He managed to get one of like the best sap pets and he said, oh my god, hello. Let's go ahead and say hello again. Come on, bro. Let me see you offer, man. I know Bank, you got something, bro. Bank, Chris. Wait, is this like Chris from Mr. Beast? Okay, he's actually giving us enchants, but sadly, they're not that good, so I have to pass. Now, I got someone pretty special to come offer for this pet. Say hello to my little redhead friend, Dejito. He's actually wanting to offer for it, so let's see what he's got to give, bro, because if this dude gives me a bad offer, bro, I'm going to beat him up. Let's just go ahead and say hi. He said hi, dad. What is this guy talking about, bruh? Okay, let's go ahead and trade him, bruh. This, this little redhead friend is a little bit weird, guys. But let's see what he has to give. Yo, hold up. Yo, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. A titanic balloon monkey that has agility and charm on it. It's okay. It's not that good. Why did this dude take everything out? Bro, what is this trash of an offer? What? Hold on. What is this garbage? Hey, I'm talking to you. Bro, what is this guy giving us 12 ninja cats? He just took it from like five titanics to this. What is this offer, bro? Oh, yeah. Okay, now we're talking. See, it's back. Wait, he has a number 25 a titanic hippo melon. He said, bro, you're garbage. Kid, this pet is worth more than your whole inventory. He also has a Titanic Blobfish Serial 38. Mine's like Serial 30. He said dot, 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 bruh. And he's adding in 500k gems. Not gonna lie, this is an insane offer, bruh. I might have to come back and take it. Let me know if I should take the Gito's offer. Here, let me go and tell him. I'll let the comments decide if I do this. Let me know, bruh. This might be the best offer we get. Who knows? I'm curious to see what other people gotta give. He said, fine, sad face, now go to bed, kid, it's past your bedtime, and okay, he just declined the trade. You know, let's see if my friend Angry wants to offer. He's actually, like, helped develop this game before, or, like, I think Petsamax, but let's see if he has to offer. 
Hey, little man, do you want to offer for a cool pet? He said, what pet? And I just put it in, bro. Let's see what my boy has to give. He said, what the heck? Okay, he's giving us a huge cheerful Yeti signed by Jamie, and, and it's rainbow. That's really rare. Only 99 exists. It's kind of funny because this is Pet Simulator 99. But, bro, yo, that is a lot of huge pets. I don't know if this beats the Gito's offer, though. I think it beats every other offer before that, though. But it is a very good offer for sure. Why is the owner of this pet called Signed Monkey? I didn't even know you could do that, bro. And it's also a huge orange balloon cat. This pet has been out for a while now. He said, is this good enough? And he added 8 million gems. Well, I don't know what to say. Uh, this is a really good offer. Probably the second best. There's also a huge capybara, which, I mean, I, I kind of have a lot of titanic capybaras from cereal 1, 2, 3, and 4. But yeah, let's go ahead and keep looking at some offers. Dude, I want to put up this pet for like a ridiculous price on my booth. Let's go ahead and just select it. A huge angel dog, bro. And let's just go ahead and enlist it for 1 trillion gems. Wait, 100 million is max. Okay, I can't do 100 million, bro. That is literally too low. I'm scared someone might actually buy it because I know there's people with 100 million out there now. Also, it's a little bit crazy to me that the person that actually got this, yes, it's currently only one in existence. I mean, if I go to Golden Pets and type in the huge angel dog, there is only one. But if they knew how they got it, then why didn't they just do it on alt accounts? So that kind of is what makes me think that this is a very hard pet to get, regardless of if you're using alt accounts or not. Mr. Savage, do you have anything to give us? Okay, I don't think this guy has an offer, bro. Let's see if my friend Razorfish wants to offer. Let's go ahead and send him a little trick because he's in our server right now. And let's see what my boy is cooking. Oh my god, bro. Lucky Block books are selling for a million gems. This is crazy. Okay, Razor's trading us. So let's go ahead and put the pet in. And let's see what he has to offer. Because I did tell him that I'm going to trade him to see if he has an offer. He said, ooh. Yeah, I bet you like that, don't you? Oh my god, yo. Okay, Titanic Red Balloon Cat signed by Jamien. 592 exists. And it's a shiny, and it's redeemed by Razor himself, my man. Wait a minute, he has four royalty charms? This is insane. As you guys know, I made a video about that and how insane those are. And bro, oh my god, this guy's giving us his own inventory. Bro also has like a bunch of other huge pets, a rainbow huge hat cat, three other titanic pets, and whoa, a golden fishing rod as well as a golden shovel wow this is insane 12 midas touch books bro oh my god bro this offer is um is insane i think this beats the cheetos offer let me know guys should i take this offer or the cheetos offer because I mean, Digito gave us a Titanic Hippo Melon, but Razorfish is giving us a shiny Titanic Red Balloon Cat and a bunch of other Titanics. And plus, bro, four royalty charms. Let's go ahead and ask him, how did you get so many royalty charms? Bro, that is actually insane. And it's a little bit funny how he hasn't actually even used them yet. Bro said El Digito, bro. Why are you getting at my boy Digito like that? Guys, we're all in the same clan. We can't be doing this. Also, 4 million gems. I completely forgot about that. He said, little secret, he he. Okay, well, good offer, but I will let the comments decide if I do it. Thank you so much, Razor. That is insane, bro. And some shiny huge pets. Are you serious? He said, ugh, okay, fine. They said, comment, yes, bro. Yeah, let me know. Should I take this one or the Gito? But overall, this pet is insane in the way in which it's obtained. Because each level of this staircase that you actually com or climb is a one in one million chance. 
And if you want to know how long that would take if each staircase or like each um, spin of a staircase takes like seven seconds, that would take you over 80 or something days. And it's going to give you all of these messages, kind of giving you hopes that you're eventually going to get to the top. But realistically, you won't. I think it's definitely worth it right now to get it, but as soon as more of these do become a thing, I would never actually do this. Because you could probably trade for this pet a lot faster if you actually go in the trading plaza and try to get different huges and a bunch of other cool stuff. And I want to keep it as low of a level as I can because I think like maybe people will see that as a more valuable thing. I could absolutely be wrong, but I wouldn't want a very rare pet to be a high level. I mean, I didn't make my huge Pegasus a very high level, but I don't think it even matters, to be honest. But just in case, I'm not going to level it up much. And a lot of you guys commented on my last video saying this is a transferred pet from Petsamax. And I wanted to point out that you can't actually even get this in Petsamax. It's not a pet in there, and you cannot transfer it into here. As you can see, this is all of the pets that I've transferred, and I'm sure if I knew this was a thing, I would have done that already. And I don't think equipping Lucky Egg books actually affects your chances of getting it. I mean, I have a bunch of books. I always equip as many that I can, but my luck's never really increased. I don't think I ever want to go back to that stairway, man. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, watch the video on the screen. It's one of my best videos yet, and I promise you will enjoy it. Until then, me and my huge angel dog will catch you all in the next one.